What's up, Buck fans? Real Bucks talk here again. We're going to talk Tristan Wirfs versus Joey Bosa. How did he fare? Pretty damn good. So Tristan Wirfs playing your right tackle, rookie right tackle. Some are saying he's playing at a Pro Bowl level. Let's see why. Just hands, body, balance, everything you want at a tackle position. Just driving Bosa down to the ground. What would you see, Plus? Yeah, Tristan has just been outstanding, especially the first four weeks of the season here against Joey Bosa. I mean, he's just displaying really good patience. He's not, you know, overstepping here, not losing balance. He's just playing in control and really just, you know, letting Bosa, you know, make the first move. And then he's reacting with his hands and, yeah, just drives him down to the ground here. Great job. Very good flow to everything. And then check his hand battling here. So let's slow it down. Bosa's going to come, fake a little inside move, and then he's going to try and push Worf's hands down. Worf says, no, 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 nay, I'm going to push your hands down. Gets him off balance. Bosa's already falling. And then Worf finishes. You're going to get right into the ground. Continuing the block still, even though he's won the block he, with that hand battle right there. He just continues the block and gets him down the ground. Face plant. Like it. Keep going on. Worf's, again, hand battling, moving with him, <laughs> dropping him down, getting rid of him. And then the ref's like, what did you just do? <laughs> That's abuse, my brother. But what did yeah. you see? Yeah, again, it's, it's like we talked about. I mean, just his patience, his balance, his footwork is in control. His hands are, you know, just being aggressive and really just fighting with Bosa and then just, yeah, arcing him down to where he wants him. And then he's just finishing him once he gets some pushed off balance here with the, the arm technique. He really kind of hooks him right there and just brings him you know, to the ground and, and keeps him off Tom Brady. Very controlled, very balanced, very fluid. It's not like it's herky-jerky and, like, not timed or anything. I mean, look at the hand placement, the timing of when he reaches. Very nice. And he's trying to get him off him. Bosa's is trying to push him off of him, of his body, with a little chuck move there. Still repositioning, moving his lower half with his upper half. Just very good stuff. I mean, we all knew he had athleticism. He didn't really show, like, the blocking concepts in, in Iowa. But, damn, he's really showing it now. He's taking to that NFL coaching, throwing him out of the club right there. Yeah. What would you see? Yeah, no, again, it's just really great technique uh, here with the hands. His footwork is really good. But I just love his balance. Like, he is just, yeah, like you said, rolling Boza out of the play. I mean, pushes him probably six, seven yards past Tom Brady. So that's definitely what you want to see and gives a nice clean pocket here for Tom. I mean, look at that. That's perfect. Everyone out of the way. Nice throwing lane. And Brozier drops it. <laughs> Got to catch that ball. All right, so this is the really, really cool play that he did. A little snap and trap. is going to try and come hard at him, gets to his chest. He immediately reads that. He goes snapping his elbows straight down. And then that makes Bosa's momentum and body weight, since it's all forward, fall down. And that's what the trap part of it is. He snaps his elbows down, then he goes down with his weight and just sits on top of him. So the fact that you're executing plays like that as a rookie against a guy like Joey Bosa who has a whole bunch of tricks in his toolbox, damn, he's trying to win with power, trying to win with quickness, trying to win with speed, and Tristan Wirfs isn't having it. What'd you see? Yeah, this is just a veteran move by a rookie. Like To, to see this kind of technique is really nice, and yeah, that's just perfect. And then, yeah, sit on him and make sure he's down. <laughs> sit <So>, on him! <laughs> yeah, so this is just really nice. And then, yeah, same here. I mean, look at him move his hands just aggressiveness um yeah bosa gets you know a little movement on the inside there but the recovery to get back on him and make sure you know he finishes and he doesn't get too close to tom brady again understanding that the ball is coming out quick so he's going to be aggressive here so good job of just yeah with that hand knocking him off balance kind of ruins the rush from yeah. uh bosa there's a so little bit just, of a jolt that does, yeah I mean, does him yeah, a little bit off balance yeah it disrupts the timing and, yeah, it gives enough time for Tom to, to make the play. Tom, terrific. And this is almost a win by Joey Bosa, but, again, it's just worse running that arc with him. He drops that outside arm, which we've seen uh, Shaq Barrett do time and time again just to get that outside edge. But the thing is, Wirfs is athletic enough to keep getting his hips wide, keep turning, keep turning, keeping his lower half with him, and just drives him outside. I mean, that gives Brady just enough space. And look what ends up happening. And, but yeah, then he throws him to the side. <laughs> and then massive game by Mike Evans. Yeah, so it's just totally. cool stuff like that where little subtle yeah. things you don't watch during the game. But after, Trisha Wirfs, this is why you get your film study. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, I just I, one thing just on this play is, is I like the little placement of the left hand. You watch Tristan Wurst's left hand right here. He's going to grab the yeah. back right there and just kind of position him where he wants. So good job there. And then, yeah, like you said, ride the arc and give – Tom enough time to make this big play to Mike Evans. Good on Mike. Yeah, he just kind of slides that left hand down, pushes his mm -hmm. hips away, 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 still under control. That's, again, veteran move stuff. Like, just because you got beat on one side doesn't mean you, the whole other side isn't able to be used. Right. And then bull rush here. Again, repositioning, anchor, drop those, that butt down, stop him from making a rush. Initial jolt, Bosa wins. Then Tristan Wurst, no, no. You ain't getting there. Yeah. You yeah, like? and that's just, that's just really good balance, and like you said, being able to anchor, he gets his hands, you know, on Boza inside, locks him up, and yeah, that's just really good. That's stopping a guy in his tracks, and yeah, this is what you want to see. I mean, Football, he's, he's yeah. one on one, low man wins. <laughs> exactly. And another big game. Just giving enough time. It's all you need. And then in the run game, he's going to drive this man outside of the stadium. <laughs> <laughs> Re-anchor. Get out of here. It's, this is what he did great in Iowa. Just driving guys back is where I knew he was going to excel at. Nasty. Yeah, it's like it's like the movie The Blind Side. You know, yeah. He's taking, <laughs> he's, he's taking them to you know the bus, taking them home. And, uh, yeah, that's really nice. Just look at the footwork, continue to move his legs. That's This is where he excels at. It's definitely his strength. Again, running game, I'll let you break down this one. Just leverage. Go ahead. Yeah, this is just a good job. Uh, he's going to jolt, you know, Joey Bosa back and just does a good job of getting his hands inside. And, yeah, continuing to move the feet is, is really nice, giving that nice lane for, for Rojo to, to get through. And, I mean, yeah, that's just – that's what you want to see. Again, just continue to move his man back. He's in, in control the whole way um, and can really take his guy anywhere he wants. So that's what makes him so deadly. And, and – this is why the Bucks, you know, traded up for him, and it's been a huge benefit because we couldn't do plays like this last year with uh, Demar Dotson back there. Yeah. Positioning, knowing where the running run is going, that's real nice stuff, and keeping the legs moving. And then this isn't Bosa, but this is what he does to guys that aren't Bosa, just throw them around. <laughs> mm -hmm. So that's a powerful arm right there that he just threw this guy, leveraging. I know my the run's coming my way. I got to get you outside. What'd you like? Yeah, I just love seeing the power here. I mean, he just picks this guy up, and he's just going to move him about a foot over and does a really good job of just controlling him right there. And then Rojo you know, finishes the run. Well, this one, uh, I think he kind of gets beat on on this one. Right. So this is where he's going inside on a stunt. you got to kind of drop him off to Kappa. I don't know if this is one of those play-action plays where they do it because there's no play-action. But Kappa's all the way out there. You can see him looking around like, oh, shit, which one of these guys do I get? And ends up getting a hit on Brady. Brady gets it out, but what could have been on a third down, OJ wide open. To me, I just credit this. Worf's just a little mental lapse because he was too locked in on Bosa, but I mean, he's a rookie. This guy's going to get better and better as the year goes on. What'd you see? Yeah, this was just miscommunication. Uh, and, you know, Kappa, yeah, shouldn't be moving outside like that. So, yeah, they just got to pass that along, and that, that will get better as they continue to play, you know, next to each other. Um, here, you know, Bosa's been getting beat pretty much the whole game, and then he's going to come with a nice little inside spin move. Uh, gets worse off balance here for the first time uh, pretty much during this whole game. So, you know, Bosa recognized that the outside wasn't working, so let's try the inside. <laughs> and uh, I think Kappa kind of pushed him pushed him down there. But yeah, because that's a anyway, hard fall for a big man. He, yeah. Anyway, that's just a great move by Joey. And, and Joey's going to win, you know, time, you know, time here and time there. I mean, he's too good of a player not to win. And then last one, this is somewhat of a win. I mean, this is that dip rip we always see Shaq do, but enough time for Tom Brady to get rid of the ball. So it's just enough. He's probably kind of doing that little outside hip reach again. But this time, it gets a little bit off balance. But if the ball's out, that's a win in my book. What'd you see? Yeah, this one I, I think is just a really good recovery by Worse. Yeah, he's he's got his hands on him. He's playing aggressive. Uh, again, Joey does a nice rip move. But look at that left hand again. You know, on his back, he's kind of guiding him where he wants to, kind of pushing him away from Tom just enough. As you see, Joey kind of has to rebalance there. It's almost uh, a late hit, a, too. <laughs> yeah, still gets a hit on Tom, uh, which you don't want to see. But, again, enough time for Tom to, to make the play. Yeah, but 
Again, guys, we're trying to talk about Tristan Wirfs, how good he's doing. He's playing at a high, high level. Guys, if you like the content, make sure to like, subscribe, do all that good stuff for us. And with that said, until the next one.